Morning guys, uh, I had a nice nine hours sleep though I still believe that six hours is better for me on a daily basis. We'll, f we'll test that theory out um, at some point. Excuse me, the plan for today is chilling basically. Um, nah, my mum's coming to meet little mad dog over here, isn't she? What you doing, Bubba? Why are you looking down like that? Oh no, what's wrong, Mag? I tried to put the couch cushions on. I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I put the couch cushions on, bro. I put the couch cushions on last night because, in reality, I don't want the couch cushions off 24-7 just so the dog can sit on the couch. <laughs> um, I put them back on. Oh, sorry. I put them on before I went to bed and then I lifted my yap. She actually let me lift her, which was nice, um, onto the couch. But then, obviously, during the night, she got down to go to the bathroom and then wasn't able to get back up. She didn't take the hint that... Our bedroom door was open and her old her bed is in there and she could come in there and sleep. Um, she's sort of just comfortable where she is. So we'll have to work on that. I definitely wanted to get, wanted to, get to a point where she's not just sitting on the couch without the couch cushions, but we'll get there eventually. My shoulders are very sore and it's becoming very apparent as I'm filming this because I have to keep switching arms. Um, so yeah, mum's coming to meet her at about lunchtime, which is in an hour's time. And then I am going to go for some form of walk to get in a bunch of steps. I don't know if I'll go to the gym and do it on the treadmill or if I'll do it outside. It's actually quite a nice day outside, so probably outside. And then um, Emily and I go into a six o'clock CrossFit class tonight. Emily finishes work at three, so she'll be home pretty early compared to what she has been the last couple of weeks. Um, I really feel like going to the gym to do like a push workout, but I know that's silly. If I'm going to CrossFit tonight, I, I probably shouldn't do it. Um, but yeah, I will uh, plan on going to the gym four times this week. Two push, two pull. So in reality, I probably should just go. We'll see. I'll, I'll think about it. Um, if I go, I'm going to have to get very used to being fatigued at CrossFit and not performing well due to the fact that I'll be doing like three sessions a day or two sessions a day sometimes. I'm just really in love with training at the moment, which is great. I haven't been in a really long time. It's good. I want to clean a lot because the house has been in disarray ever since Maggie moved in. Um, not that it's a bad thing that she moved in. Is it little Maggie? It's not a bad thing that you moved in. We love having you around. You're the best. You're the best. She don't, generally looks more comfortable than this when I'm patting her. She loves chin scratches. Don't you? Huh? Yeah, chin scratches are good. Um, it's been in disarray since she got here, so I sort of want to clean it up again. I eventually, sometime soon, want to get my room completed with like an armchair that I can read in and stuff, but we'll get there soon. That's all I have to say for now. I will film more later. Hello. Let's go. Good girl. Yeah. Obviously, this means I was able to get the lead on Maggie. I apologise for the wind. We've taken on her for the first walk since she's moved in with us. She's very scared, but this is genuinely the thing that's going to help her build confidence, pushing her out of her comfort zone into things that she's not that comfortable with, because um, that's what got her to let us pat her in the first place, is taking her better way. So now putting the lead on her and bringing her outside, I, re I reckon that's going to help as well. Max. You'll be a confident dog yet, I promise you. The love life. She's such a good girl and this is getting her out there and I'm really, really happy. Good girl. I'm so sore that it's difficult to hold the camera up right now. Um, it's been a really good day. My mum came over. Um, we went and had lunch. I didn't eat. Because I'm being very, very, very good. Um, but mum had lunch and it was good. She met a little mag dog over here. Maggie! Maggie! As you can probably see, she doesn't have a collar on because I took her for a walk earlier and everything went well. She was a bit scared. I took the time to sit down outside and she actually hopped onto my lap and let me pat her. And then she let me carry her, um, which was surprising. But we just tried to take her for a walk after Emily and I had dinner and she slit the, the lead when we, the, her collar when we were downstairs. Thankfully she just wanted to come back inside, um, which was good. But 
yeah, haven't been able to get the collar back on her. She almost bit Emily when Emily tried to put the collar back on. But it's good that she slipped it because now we actually have her name tag on there. So I finally put the chairs back into the dining room, on, into the on the dining table because I was sick of them not being there. We'd taken them away three weeks ago when Maggie first arrived and she sort of hid under them. But obviously she's not really doing that anymore. You're just chilling with us like normal, aren't you, little girl? Making progress with her, it's good. Emily and I went to CrossFit, it was freaking hard. Um, the strength component was doing five sets of five squat cleans. Um, oh, sorry, hang power hang cleans. And then after each set, you did 20 push ups. So, like, we did push ups yesterday as well, and today all of the um, rolls and stuff were taken during the warm up. So, I did 10 burpees for each. Um, for like the warm up, so I did 20 burpees in total, and then I obviously did 100 push ups. <laughs> um, so I'm cooked. Oh no, and I did more push ups because push ups were a part of the warm up. So, <laughs> how many push ups did we do? So, 10 by 2, 120, 120 push ups, and, 30, and 20 burpees today. Ah, <sighs> that's crazy. And then the workout was. 10 of all of the things I'm about to mention, 10 push press, 10 wall balls, and then 10 calories on the roller, and then 20 of each of those, and then 30 of each of those, and then 15 strict pull-ups, and 15 band dips. I'm cooked, but my goal is 15,000 steps a day. It's 9.30 right now, and I've only done 8,500 steps. Um, Emily's about to go to bed. I'm going to drive to the gym, go on the treadmill to get my steps in, and I'm considering doing a pull workout even though I'm really, really sore, considering doing a pull workout, even though I did two pull and only one push last week, considering doing it because I'm so sore, I don't want to do a push today, I'll probably do that and then do a push workout tomorrow before or after work and then do a pull workout the day later, which is a Thursday, and then do one more push workout on Friday and then Saturday, a complete rest day before our half marathon. But yeah, anyway, I'm gonna go do that. So I'm gonna say goodbye for today. Tomorrow I have a look at two. It's going to be a good day. Thanks for watching. Hope you're doing well. Take care and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.